So this is Aaron with Great Vibrations. A manufacturer just sent us an oscillation plate. We've been talking a lot about this on the thread, the difference between vertical vibration and oscillation. Uh, like I said, one of the manufacturers sent us an oscillation plate to try, um, claiming this is the most high-end oscillation plate out there. So if you take a look at the two, the one to your left is vertical vibration. The one to your right is oscillation. I'm gonna show you both the settings are the same. So same settings. We're gonna have Levi go ahead and step up on the oscillation plate and you can take a look and see what it looks like. Now, Levi is no small guy, weighing in at a good 280 pounds. And if you take a look, bend your legs a little bit, Levi. Look how his entire body is literally shaking. Not good. Sheer stress to the joints, hips, shaking your head. How's your head feel, Levi? I, I guess a little bit rocking back and forth. <laughs> Okay, so go ahead and step off that one, and we're gonna step onto the vertical vibration plate. As you can see, no lower body movement whatsoever. Getting the same muscle contractions, in fact, more contractions, but there is no movement to the lower body at all. How's your head feel, Levi? No shaking I can in the stand head. This all day. Nothing. So there you go. There's a perfect example of the difference between oscillation and true linear vibration.